would like to see how to make the new McDonald's triple cheeseburger at home for £1.66. Stay tuned. See me walking around on the boy about town that you heard of. See me walking the streets on the top of the world that you heard of. It's food o'clock. So, this week, McDonald's released a triple cheeseburger in their saver menu for, I think, £2.19. Pence. Well, I'm going to show you how to make that burger at home. And the ingredients actually cost me £1.66. So, you know, they call it a saver menu. I've got a better saver menu. So what are you going to need? You're going to need a bun. Okay. Three slices of your American cheese. A little bit of chopped onion. Okay. And three dill pickles. I'll put them down the side here. Okay, you're going to want some tomato ketchup, Heinz tomato ketchup. And you're going to want some French's yellow American mustard. Okay, then we get on to the beef. Now, these burgers um, that McDonald's make, right, and they're actually two ounces. So I've got three balls of my 80-20 chuck. So this is going to be miles better than a McDonald's burger because this is 80-20 this is ground chuck. So you've seen me do this before. To make the burgers, we use one of these. So without further ado, let's make the burgers. So to make the burgers, I'll take them off out. I'll get some parchment paper. I'll drop a ball on. This is like a wax, wax paper. Get the other part like that. Get the burger press. And basically, smash it out. And then you can get your burger and just tidy it up a bit. Just knock the... There we go, there's my 100% beef burger. Just put that there, do the other two. You just repeat the process. If you don't have something like this, okay, just something heavy with a flat, with a flat bottom to it. Same again, when it's done, you just... And as always, I'm gonna be cooking these on the, on the Weber with the, with the plancher on my Weber kettle. You can, if you want, do them in your frying pan at home. You know, you haven't got to do these on a barbecue. And they don't take long because, because it's such a thin burger, you know, um, in these cheeseburgers. So there we go. That's... That's the three burgers made. Simple, 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 simple. Anyone can do this. So let's get to the barbecue and let's cook these bad boys up. And the next time you'll see me, we'll be assembling the burger. Um, we're going to just lightly toast the um, the burger bun first. And then we will do, do the burgers, put the cheese on, bring them back here and then assemble them. So catch you shortly. <laughs>
running, so let's knock this bad boy up. Right, first things first, we get the bun, like so, and we get the burger, which is quite messy. Like so. We slide the burger on top, like that. Okay, you then get the crown of the burger. You want some ketchup, shake first. Like so. Get your French's mustard. Like so. And what they then do, three dill pickles, a little sprinkle of your chopped onion, and we get the lid or the crown and push it down. So here it is, the iconic, brand new McDonald's triple cheeseburger. Cost £2.19 at McDonald's, I have made it for £1.66. But like anything, it's got to be in the taste test. So let's take a bite of this bad boy. It's actually quite hard to sort of get, get around because it's so big. I'm going to say this now, that probably tastes better than the McDonald's version. So, if you'd like to try this recipe, please do. This is exactly a replica, a copy of the iconic cheeseburger. So, give, give, give the recipe a try. See what you think. Leave a comment below. Give us a big thumbs up if you like the, the review. Um, hit that little bell, get notified every time I bring out a new video. And of course, subscribe to the channel. And like I always say, beer is the answer, but I cannot remember the question. Thank you for watching. Good night. <coughs> TT says, never play with matches, fireworks, and always drink responsibly. <laughs>